So I was talking about the parable of the tares and the wheat. Now, the tares are the children of the wicked one. While men slept, the enemy planted his own people. And it was like, ding, ding, ding. While we have not been under an awakening in America, Satan planted people. This is where my little, my little you know, characters here. Satan planted a, a Fauci. Boom, you see? And, uh, and, and Satan planted a Kamala. And uh, Satan plants an Ocasio. And you, you say, well, what are you talking about, Lance? I'm saying that these people, Satan's goal is to put his people at the helm of the gates of influence. Because if they're in charge of the gates of influence, I guess this is Pelosi here. Uh, if This is Pocahontas. If, if these people are at the gates of influence, they can control what comes in. Think of it like a spiritual thing. Satan wants to get access. <laughs> Satan wants to get access to America, but he can't unless he has a priesthood or a powerful group of people where the gates of influence and authority are so they can direct the ruling, they, they could direct the land, they could put the uh, news on the air, they could uh, hold the gavel for investigations. What can they do? If, if Satan can get the right people in, they could thwart, dare I say, will drive people crazy, they will thwart the one who God sent as a Cyrus or as a leader to help preserve America, to try to protect it. The devil can take him out, boom, corruptly, and put his own priesthood in. 